Um, how did you find out about the um, mascot program that they had? Oh, well, I used to be in the band, oh, okay. and I know a few of the dance team members, and they would, the cheerleading captain to tell everybody to tell people that they know that the trials are coming, and I came to try that. So. Okay, and you said you used to be in the band. Why did you leave the band? Just, I wanted to be, I always wanted to be the mascot, but I never found out about the trials to this year. Okay. So was the band like kind of like a, just a filler thing you were trying to do until you found, found out about the mascot position? Something like that, yeah. Oh, okay. Um... From my understanding, they give out like a scholarship for it. Um, is it a full ride scholarship? Yeah, yeah. we get, uh, well, since it's two of us, we split the full. Okay. Is it always two people that no. does it? Okay, why did they um, choose two people this year? Because they uh, they needed more more uh, council appearances and more than one person tried out this year. So. Okay. Um, so do you the popularity, like, have you seen like an increase in like people knowing you or Knowing who you are, because of being pouncer. No, not really. That not that many people know who I am. Okay. But you know, it's just getting a little bit the people. Uh, most of the people that after I take it off. Yeah. Sometimes if they see me, then yeah. Okay. How um, like how hot does it get under the? Well, whatever degree it is outside is thirty degrees hotter inside. Is it? But I know with being in a hot suit like that and, you know, working out, going across the field, you could um, easily lose weight. So have you seen, like, a drop in your weight or a change yeah. in your weight? Yeah, and uh, with the Fan Fest, I was in it for uh, two hours straight. I lost five pounds that day. Can you, like, kind of tell us about your audition, like, what music you use? Uh, well, for the audition, we, we, uh, I was, we all had to uh, come up with a skit. Mm -hmm. It had to be from... Two to five minutes. Okay. Uh, well, I basically my skit. I um, was acting like I was working out, and I had a jug of water with the Tennessee logo on it, and a jug of water with the University of Memphis logo on it. While I was lifting, I got tired, and I tried to drink the University of Tennessee uh, water, but it didn't work. It didn't help me. So I tried to change it to the Memphis water, and it helped me. I could be able to lift everything, and then I just did some. Just dance for another two and a half minutes. Okay. I, I was the only one that came up with the skit. And while we have trials, it, it's people all in here. So we have to entertain them and this was the most. So it was the audition in here? Mm -hmm. And about like how many people were in here? It's about a good 300 people. Because the cheerleaders, the people that's trying out for cheerleaders and the dance team, they'll be here and their parents will be here or some of the football team will be here. Mm -hmm. I dance uh, to swag surf. I did a spanky leg. It was uh, like this old, one of the football players from 2005 had made a song called the Tiger Remix, and I did mm -hmm. that song too. Can you only be pouncer for a year? Like, do you no. have to? You can be as long as you want to, you keep trying out. But, like, most times, uh, people still do it because no one comes to try out. Oh, okay. You just have to try out again. If you because Taylor tried out again, but didn't. Okay. And do you plan on trying out again next yeah. year? Okay. What do you find most enjoyable about being a counselor? Uh, probably the little kids. Because they really uh, clean to you. Oh, okay. Some of them, they're not scared and they really clean to you. There's a lot of them that's like, really scared of them. But, uh, just trying to keep the crowd into it. I get a chance to basically be as silly as I want to be. Okay. And are you that like silly outside the costume or do you kind of like, you know, change when you get into the costume? No, I'm a, it's probably, I'm silly outside but it like doubles when I'm in the suit. Okay. What's one of the craziest things so far since you've been past that you've done at a game? Like it's hard to get attention. Uh, probably fall down from stairs. Didn't feel good at all, <laughs> but the kids mm -hmm. like it, so. Have you ever had days like you just really don't feel like being hyped, but you know you have to um, when you become counselor? No, not really. Have there been um, a day like that? No, not yet. Not yet. Because mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. most of the time people remember you from being a mascot more than they remember people that play a certain sport. Mm 